Lekking Greg Vegan Camp, the 1st of March 2023. As you can see, you cannot see the mountains. It's very foggy. Not because it's fog, it's because there's like smoke, a layer of bad air. Cannot really smell the smoke, but yeah, it's not good. Hovering just above AQI, PM 2.5, above 100. And I'm using a mask like this because I can uh, wash it whenever I want and I don't need to have 1000 masks. I can use this mask for, I think, uh, like these filters I change once a year or something like that. Avocado. Mangoes. Some mango trees are doing really well. Mangoes all around. And others are not. The dying tree is actually giving some mangoes. Some mango trees are still very green and beautiful. But there are still these mango leaf hoppers or whatever hopping around which is not so good for example on this tree you can see the many leaves have like a dark black mold and uh, the flowers are also very moldy and probably most of these flowers and if there are any mangoes developing they will probably also die because of the black mold that is caused by these insects and even though there is like some moldy stuff here on these mangoes that are more local, not the Nam Dok Mai, seems that they are developing anyway. Pretty nice mangoes. Here's another example of uh, a tree with very heavy damage from the black mold. And you can see the new shoots are coming. I got some help from uh, different visitors here and uh, we've been uh, spraying different fungi on these trees to try to stop these all these insects destroying the whole thing but let's see what happens and as you can see this uh, tree has also a lot of black mold damage but we have one two three mangoes from the first mango flowering and I don't know if the second wave will get anything. Here's an example of the first wave mango and a couple of second wave mangoes that look healthy. Second wave mango, second wave mango. And here you can see that we still are using the lime stone to paint the trunks so we avoid too many bugs climbing up the trees because they don't like it. So limestone paint is just limestone mixed with water. This is like a mango tree in the new land, a small one, and it's a little bit outside the area of the normal mangoes we have over there. But this mango is more isolated and surrounded by other plants and it's just much more healthy. Or at least it looks like it's much more healthy. And on behind we have a lime tree, you see it's nice and flowering and it has like small children we call it in Thai. Look, me look, and it's just wonderful. The neighborland, maybe it will be a big amazing mango forest too one day. Longans are also flowering, a majestic red cavendish. And the majestic beehive. Casper and Senna harvested a whole uh, cassava, cassava plant and all the roots and planted a new one. Strawberries are pretty active and also the tomatoes are pretty active over there and also the dogs are pretty active. 
especially in the night. Right, Naruto? So these young avocados here in the dry season, they're being watered about one time per week. Some of them look very happy and healthy, and others not so much, like this one. But it's actually shooting a new one, so it might survive if we take care of it. So I have, uh, I don't know how many meters of black pipe. Soft, not super hard, but not super soft black pipe. And then the 30 meter hose on a roll to, to water these.